Welcome to this video tutorial on the topic of full arch scan with Serec Prime Scan. With Prime Scan, scanning is easy and straightforward. You can achieve very good results directly without any special scan strategy. If you don't have a preferred scan workflow yet, this is a scan strategy that is easy to learn and works well. We have already set up our patient and the indication. We are now in the acquisition phase. The default image catalogs, lower jaw, upper jaw, and buckle are displayed at the lower edge of the screen. A full arch scan can be performed with just three sweeps, and we are going to start with a scan of the lower jaw. The starting point is always occlusal at the most distal tooth, regardless of whether this is the lower or upper jaw. A distance of 2 mm between the scanner and the tooth surface is recommended. After the first 3D images, we sweep our prime scan by 60 degrees to the lingual and scan to the opposite most distal tooth. From here, we continue with an occlusal scan over the incisal edges in the anterior region until the most distal tooth on the opposite side. After reaching this spot, we sweep the scanner again by 60 degrees to the vestibular and scan back to the most distal tooth on the opposite side. Missing scan data can be rescanned at the end. Afterwards, we switch to the upper jaw image catalog. Since the scan strategy is the same as with the lower jaw, we skip the scan procedure here, and next you see the already scanned upper jaw image catalog. As demonstrated with the lower jaw, we have scanned the upper jaw, including the surrounding gingiva, with just three sweeps. Additionally, it is also possible to scan the palate. To do this, you start palatinally in the incisal area between the crown of the tooth and palate, and then sweep the prime scan from one side to the other until the end of the palate has been reached. Afterwards, we switch to the buckle image catalog. In the case of a full arch scan, with Serec Prime Scan and the Serec Software 5, you can perform a bilateral scan. For this, we scan the vestibular on one side, sweep the scanner in this area from gingiva to gingiva until the image catalog of both the upper and the lower jaw appears in the background. As soon as a small green box with a check mark is displayed, the Serec Software has merged both 3D models into a bite occlusion. Additional buckle scan on the opposite site can be scanned in the same image catalog. This increases the accuracy in the allocation of the two jaws. After successful scanning of the default image catalogs, we can switch to the next phase, the model phase, either by tapping the arrow to the right at the lower edge of the screen or on the phase bar. Thank you very much for your attention. We would like to wish you every success when working with Serec.